Squad, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, then hi, welcome. My name is Do Darling, or if you've been watching me for a while now, then thanks for sticking around. So, I know, I know it is well past Christmas, it is even well past New Year's, but I really wanted to do this video, and I have been trying to do it earlier, but you know, my partner gave me the wonderful, wonderful gift of sickness. So, if my voice sounds worse than normal, is that even possible? And if I look like death, then you know why. So, let's just get into the video before it is Christmas 20 freaking 20. Now, I feel like it's really easy to get me gifts because I have specific, let's call them what they are, obsessions. And I think by now, we all know that one of them is Queen. <laughs> But I have a few others, so I feel like people just buy me something to do with that obsession and I will love it. But I want to know what is your like main interest, obsession, hobby that people always buy you things related to. So let me know in the comments. I want to find out what you guys are into. Although I'm sure some of you are into Queen like me because maybe you watch my Queen reactions. Um, so I'm going to start with the queen related gifts that I got. Do I love it? Am I gonna wear it? Of course. And I don't have one like this. It's just with the with the queen logo on, but yeah. Ta -da, this is what it looks like. I like it, I'm gonna wear it. I already have like 1 million t-shirts, but you can never have too many t-shirts, especially when they have queen on, right? Right. Right. Then I also got some fun little gifts like this little magnet with Freddy on and little pin badge. I collect pin badges so this is really cool. I got the Queen official calendar which I have yet to open because I've been waiting for this video. So let's get it open and get it on to January because that is what we are on. Ooh. Did anyone else get this? Okay, let's have a look. I mean, wow. Look what Brian is wearing. Look at that. Look like cardigan. So here we have, this is January. We have a lot of pictures here. Yeah, so it's really cool. I'm going to put that up and a look at Queen every single day. I also got this little canvas with Freddy on. How nice is that? It's so colourful and cool. It's going to go up in my room. Doesn't that look cool? I love it. I also got this picture of Freddy. It is a really cool picture of him. So this next gift I actually bought for myself, but I couldn't resist. So if you don't know, I collect vinyls. I have a modest vinyl collection. This is only my second ever Queen album. I've never heard I'll listen to the um, jazz album, but it is the limited edition pink vinyl one. So I just really, I just really wanted it. So if you guys want me, maybe I will show you like on a video my vinyl collection. Although I don't have that many vinyls. I, I'm just starting out. There's a few interesting ones, but I just really love vinyls. I love the whole ritual of taking it out of the sleeve and putting it on and moving the arm and putting the needle down. And I just love how they crepitate. It's just, oof. yeah. You know what? Let's open this. I know a lot of people probably are going to get this and not even open it because they want to keep it as a collector's thing. But I am one of these people that likes to live for today and um, when I get things, I like to use them. So, ooh, ooh, oh gosh. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, I didn't know this was inside. That's another thing I love about vinyls. It's like you're opening like a, you have like a little package and you can keep it and uh, enjoy it. And I like it. Okay, so, ooh. Oh, so this is all the song lyrics. I don't know these songs. Let me entertain you dead on time in only seven days. Dreamers ball. I, you know, I'm going to be reacting to all these songs before I even listen to this vinyl. So don't even worry about that. I've got a lot of songs to react to. And now let's look at this. 
this, this, this. Oof. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, hello. Hello. Ah, this is what I want to see. This is what we want to see. Oh my gosh, it is shocking pink. Damn. Look at this. So pink. Oof. Oh my gosh, I love it. I can't wait until I can play it. But we must react. Ooh, it has fat bottom girls on here. And bicycle race. Uh, those are the only two I know. So, yeah. More songs to react to. So this is not like an actual like specific queen merchandise. like, But it is queen related because it's a little necklace that says queen on it with a little crown and it's in rose gold. I don't know if you can see that but it says queen on it. And it's super cute. And the final Freddy Queen thing that I got was this card because I actually just joined the Queen fan club and so I got this at Christmas and it has like the signatures on and I was just like so blown away. I was not expecting it and I was like so happy and like Okay, so the next kind of genre of gifts are going to be all like beauty and fashion related. So the first thing I have is this huge hamper that I have not opened yet, but apparently it is full of vegan beauty products. So why don't we just dive inside? Oh, it smells good. A moisturizer, mm. balm to oil cleanser. This is from PS Naturals. I think this is the Primark range. I think. Some, someone let me know. I think so. Uh, we have face masks and cleansing wipes. And what are these? Body butters. Like, there is a lot. So, um, ooh. We have rhubarb and custard soap. Wow, look at this. It's vegan, cruelty free, handmade. Look at these. These are so cool. Oh, everything smells like it, there was, there's a lot of smells. And this is first love. Oh. It looks like a little uh, horseshoe. I don't know. Um, this is so super nice. I'm so grateful for all of this. What do we have here? Body scrubs, lime and ginger. Should we have an open of one and have a... Whoa. Whoa. Look at that. Looks like guacamole or something. It looks like mint chalk ice cream. But don't eat it. So the next thing I got was from my partner and it absolutely blew my mind. I was so shocked. I was not expecting it. Now we both watched the Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson videos together and yes I was one of those people who sat for five hours trying to get the palette and ended up with just one lipstick which I do love. I got Jeffree What The Fuck lipstick and I do love it but I couldn't get a palette. There's no chance of getting a palette so I wasn't even thinking about anything and my partner is one of those people, they don't have social media, they really don't go online, they're not like online, they're not like a tech person, they don't really go use the internet that much and so when on Christmas day I opened a package and I instantly saw pink, I'm like you really did that? Like how? Like I didn't even think that they would be able to go online and find anything Jeffree Star Cosmetics and buy me it like it it you don't understand it shook me it shook me to my car and when I opened this I literally squealed because I love Jeffree Star Cosmetics because they're vegan and cruelty free but they're also like really good freaking quality like really good and the only thing I have is like the concealer a couple of lipsticks and the mini jawbreaker palette that's all I have so when I opened this, I was I was like, oh my gosh. So they got me the mirror and it's in rose gold, which I really love rose gold. They said they got it to match my phone, which is also rose gold. But yeah, it's a cute little 
star mirror i i love it like yeah so i i was shocked opening this i was shocked i was so happy it it yeah it meant a lot because i think it took them a lot to be able to work out and find the website and find out how and what and i just didn't expect it you know so it was just a nice surprise but then but then sorry i'm gonna have to sh shift my legs going to sleep the next thing i opened they only gone and got me freaking blue blood palette i mean what the heck i was like this is too much this is too much i know you've all probably seen this a million times but i haven't and it was like oh my gosh we're gonna have to try some of these out we're gonna have to try some of these looks so it opens here and you open it like this and look 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 at all those colors now i don't really ever use blue so i was like oh how am i going to use this but actually there's not just blue this like what's jumping out to me is this like purple but also this glittery blue but like this green here this green i love these like beigey oranges and like we have like a little pink like there's a lot of colors but ocean ice it looks so good so i couldn't believe my look i'm like I am so spoiled right now. Like, I am so freaking lucky to get the mirror and uh, and blue blood. It's like, what more could a girl ask for? Well, apparently, is that the right way? Blood sugar palette. And I'm like, no, <laughs> you need to stop. Like, are you for real? So they got me blood sugar as well. <sighs> I've wanted this palette since I first ever saw it. It's just got every colour in it that I love. So it has two clasps. And I mean, look, just, just look. It is so freaking gorgeous. That gold looks amazing. I love all the reds, cherry soda, fresh meat, blood sugar, extraction, like, mm-hmm. I am more than happy. I am more than happy. I couldn't even express how happy I was with them. Like, they meant so much. Okay, so the next thing I got was socks. Now, I know it's like a running joke, like, oh, you got socks. Like, everyone gets socks. But I freaking love getting new socks. Like, to me, that is an amazing present. I love socks. Give me all the socks. Putting on a fresh pair of socks. Like a new fresh pair of socks. Mmm. Yes. That is that is my my heaven. So I got a lot. I got a lot. We have like look. Big Bang Theory socks. We have cactus socks. We have more cactus socks. By the way, I love cactuses. You'll find out in a minute. More cactus socks. More big bang socks. These Cat, cat, cause socks. I don't know how to say it. We have little. Uh, I don't know what this is. A panda socks. We, we have all the socks. So I'm gonna be putting on a nice new pair of socks every day for quite some time and enjoying it. So just know that. I also got some clothes. I got this dress. I haven't tried any of these on yet. So um. But it looks super sparkly. Like, damn, I need somewhere nice to go to wear it. But it's like, um, what what would you call this? Like a halt neck? Because it comes to that. And then, oh my gosh, look how sparkly it looks. So it goes like this. And it goes to, I would say, let's have a look. I'm not sure. Let me look. Oh. Oh. So it goes to, I would say, just like above the knee. So, oh my gosh, this looks incredibly sparkly. Look at that. And it's got like a sort of sparkly, kind of like lacy, and then it has like a under, underlay, like shiny underlay. So, ooh, 
I will have to try that on in a video. Why is this literally giving me Jessica Rabbit vibes though? Like, I'm not bad. Ooh, I was just drawn that way. Is that what she says? I don't know. But we will try it on soon. Um, then I got some t-shirts, which are pretty cool. And they're all super soft, which I freaking love. More t-shirts. This, this one killed me. I really like this one. And it's so soft. Soft t-shirts. Yes, please. We have this cactus t-shirt. Um, as I mentioned, I love cacti. Try not to say cactuses, which I really want to say, but it is cacti. Let me show you why. Say hello to Mr. Prickles. You may have seen him in my videos before, all my live streams because he is the little mascot on my live streaming channel where we actually went out shopping one day and we spotted him and he was like this big and he was all bent to one side and no one wanted him he was just like all lonely and we was like no we're gonna adopt him and we did and look how much he has grown and he is thriving he is living his best life and I love cactuses and I love Mr. Prickles, so people buy me cactus things, which I ain't complaining about. I love cacti. So sticking with the cactus theme, I was bought this LED neon cactus light, which is gonna go in my studio. Super cool, super funky, love it. These two little like fake cactus plants. I got this little like trinket dish with a cactus on. I also got this cute cactus cup and it has like a little flower on the top, see that? How cool is that? Um, so yeah, that's super cute. Why do I need to mime how to drink? I'm sure you know how to drink out of a cup. And I got some cactus themed notepads, which is always gonna come in handy. And some little cactus erasers. They are so cool. They are so cute. Also got this little cactus like hanging sign, which I absolutely adore from my sister. It says every day, do one thing that prickles your fancy. I thought that was so super cute. I really like that. Now you may not know this, but one of my other obsessions is Vincent van Gogh. I actually got this t-shirt of Vincent from my friend for Christmas. It's kind of like Banksy cross Vincent. So it's super cool. I, I adore Vincent's work and yeah. So let me show you the Vincent van Gogh. Vincent van Gogh. So let me show you the Vincent van Gogh gifts that I got. At Eternity's Gate. I've already seen it, but I really love it. It's like one of my films that I really love. So I was really grateful to get it on DVD. If you haven't seen it, oh my gosh, check it out. It is a wonderful film. I really enjoyed this film, like a lot. This book, uh, Lust for Life, the story of Vincent van Gogh. So yeah. I've already started reading it. And then this fabulous book, which I absolutely adore. It has all pictures of his work and like a little bit about them. And I, I just adore his paintings. Like I, yeah. So I love this book. I also got a few more books. I got this little pocket book of the Beatles. It's all quotes from the Beatles. I've been really enjoying reading this book. And I also got a few vegan cookbooks. I got this one, Eat Vegan, loads of recipes inside. Really super cool. And the Eat Raw Kitchen. Um, so I'm guessing this is, yeah, all raw vegan food, which I'm really excited to try some of this because I've actually been vegan for six years now. Yay! It's my six year vegan anniversary. So I will be doing some uh, videos on Veganuary, trying some of the new vegan food that's out. And um, I'm gonna do a question and answer. So I'm gonna do that on my Instagram. So if you don't follow me on Instagram, then go follow me. It's the same name, Vegan Dough. Same name everywhere, Vegan Dough. Keep it easy and simple. So um, yeah, I will ask you guys if you have any questions to do with veganism. Maybe you're thinking about it. Maybe you wanna find out a bit more. Maybe you have some questions and um, then I will do a video answering those questions. So 
watch out for that. Now, I want to show you one of the most amazing gifts that I got that I love so, so much. It, it meant so much to me. So the first thing I opened was this mug and it says Hillside Animal Sanctuary, give animals a treat, don't eat meat. Now I've heard of this sanctuary before, it's quite well known, they have like, I don't know, like 2,000 animals they have got rescued and I was like, oh, someone bought me something from their website, like one of the one of the mugs so the money's like gone to help the animals i really appreciate that and then also it came with this, this little little pig key ring and i was like huh cool cute nice i love it little did i know <laughs> little did i know i then got this envelope and i'm like okay i open it up and it is full 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 of stuff and i see this i'm like oh my gosh how adorable look at the little doggy look at the little piggy pigs are one of my favorites i love all animals i'm not gonna lie i am a massive animal lover but i love little piggies like oh. see how freaking cute and i opened it up and i was shook i i, I was just shook it says Dear friend, thank you for choosing to adopt me. I'm writing to tell you all about myself and to send you this photograph with me, Brandy, one of the little dogs who was rescued at the same time as me from a dreadful puppy farm in Wales. In a way, we were both saved from the factory farming industry where animals are intensively reared. And it says the whole story of this little piggy and how they were saved and they now live in the sanctuary and oh, they are safe and they are happy and it just oh my gosh so someone adopted this pig this pig is called billy griffin there's a little adoption certificate and um, so we're sponsoring Billy for, I think it's for a year at the Hillshire Horse Sanctuary. And yeah, it's called Billy Griffin. He's a large white pig. He was born on the 27th of June, 2009, and he was rescued on the 28th of June, 2009. So one day old. So I just, that meant so much to me. I just, yeah, so yeah, they have 2,000 other rescue animals. I think these are all the different animals that they rescue. Like, this is the best gift. This is the best gift, like, ever I could ask for. And it doesn't, it doesn't stop. It doesn't stop. So, um, I got this as well. It's like an invitation where it says, you can come and meet. Meet. Billy. So, uh, I think it's a little far, I'm not sure exactly, but I feel determined that I want to go to the sanctuary now and actually meet the pig that someone adopted for me and um, oh my gosh, you know, sometimes it is hard. I don't want to make veganism about me or about vegans because it's not, it's about animals. But sometimes being vegan in a non-vegan world can be hard. Just seeing the cruelty um, all around you and sometimes feeling helpless and sometimes it just weighs on you and it can get to you and it gets you down when you see uh, the horrific things that are happening to animals and oh my gosh, let's not even... Like, when I think about Australia and I think about the fires burning and the people losing their lives and their homes and all the animals that are dying and all the animals that are dying in factory farms right now. It is heavy, you know, it is heavy. So I feel like sometimes going, be able to go to a sanctuary and see happy animals, animals that have been rescued, animals that are not facing that future, it would just, you know, 
it just helps a little bit to be like, no, you know, this, this is the right thing. This is, uh, you know, yeah. So I, I'm determined to try and try and go visit. And if I do, I will film a live stream, of course. Um, there was quite a few of the things that came in the like little adoption pack. There was like this Christmas card that also features Billy on the front. There is some leaflets as well. Um, there is this cute little like money box you can make to raise money around to send to them as well. And there is this booklet what shows all the different all the different animals that they rescue and their stories and yeah that was one of the gifts that I just I just was I wasn't expecting it it was so thoughtful it was so kind I I I really love the gift um I have adopted animals before but this that was from Viva charity so on my birthday last year I ended up adopting eight animals <laughs> Got a bit carried away, adopted a, it was like sheep, duck, goose, pigs, um, a pony, a fox, a dog. <laughs> um, but how can you resist? Like, they're, they're wonderful charities and these make great gifts and yeah. I was so, so happy, so happy. Now, I feel like I've missed like a lot of gifts. I got a lot of things and I'm so grateful and I feel so spoiled and so lucky um so I feel like I've missed some things because there's a lot and I feel like this video has already been hella long so let me just show you a couple of final things as I remember them my partner also made me this they made it out of a solid piece of wood it says my name it says dough I love it it took them so long I appreciate it and also with squirrel because if you don't know I love squirrels so and my other friend Med that you've probably seen on this channel before I will link the video we did together we're doing some more videos again soon for Veganuary so um stay tuned got me vegan candy floss and whew, um, cup which they said suited me perfectly and the thing I love so much is this framed drawing that they actually drew of me that's a drawing that they did of me. Okay, so that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoy seeing what I got for Christmas. If you're not already subscribed, then please make sure you subscribe. And I will see you again in the next video. Bye!